Hi everyone, welcome back again to City Systems video presentation. Now, in this video presentation, I will show you how to uh, install your GPRS 14 inside your control panel MT6250. So this is your uh, module, the GPRS 14 has two SIM card uh, slot, SIM2 and SIM1. Okay, if you have a SIM card, just only insert here in the SIM1. Can insert it here in, into the same one once you insert the same card now it's time to open your control panel this one just open okay then as you can see here there, uh, there is a terminal this term this terminal is for your GPRS 14 see this one okay just, just plug it okay. once you plug and already the SIM card is inserted now it's time to close your panel okay once done then start to power on okay. so after it's power on once the SIM card is inserted in, uh, in this panel you will see here the light indicator as same this one it means that SIM card is working and the signal string it will appear here okay now let's proceed how to add your mobile number uh, into this panel to uh, to receive uh, SMS and calling uh, to program the uh, to program in adding the mobile number just press menu then press next until system setup okay then input here the 40 then next until communication or communicator this one then press ok user call list ok then add telephone number one in this panel you can add uh, eight mobile number ok so first first mobile number add telephone number one ok then put here the mobile number example this one so this is your mobile number then press ok voice call the default is to so make it yes so you can receive the calling the next also uh, also sms make it yes the next in zone alarm make it uh, yes also so just press edit to make it yes since uh, because uh, i don't have a zone area so let it, uh, uh, let it back so i will first register the zone because i don't have zone i forget it okay so Example this one, okay. Okay, now I have zone. Now I will program the or add the mobile number. Then go to system setup again and enter for zero. Then next until communicator. Okay, and user call is okay. Add telephone number one, okay. Uh, wait, I will delete this one yes okay add telephone number one make it okay then input here the mobile number you want to receive this mo this mobile number is uh, the person who, who was uh want to receive a call or sms example is the mobile number okay just make it okay then voice call yes next sms make it yes the next zone alarm make it yes so the default is no so make it yes edit then yes then zone alarm next all zone yes of course make it yes and panic no arming no if you make it yes this one every time you make arm in this arm your panel you will receive uh, uh you will receive uh sms or call so make it no okay disarming no and trouble yes of course right maybe some of uh, maybe some of your detector has a uh, uh, battery low so you will receive an sms or the battery failure or uh, line failure any, uh, any types of trouble you will receive an, an SMS so this is the important so make it yes the next all trouble yes and another te telephone number if you wish to add an, uh, another telephone number just make it no as the same program as what we did in telephone number one then uh, if no just make it no okay now exit now after you add the mobile number 
So now just proceed for the activation of your uh, GSM. How? Just go uh, go back to menu again. Just press next until you will reach the system setup. Then make it okay. Then input the four zero. Press next again. Then go to communicator. Okay. Then user call list. Make it next. Same card. Next. Account setup. Okay. Then account number. Make it next. Then here. GSM in land. Okay. Just press this one. Okay. Now the, the default is land. So since you are, you are using the uh, GPR support in the GSM. Uh, you can uh, you uh, you need to uh, change uh, change it to GSM because if you will not receive the default will be land so your SIM card will not activate it so make it GSM then the primary now is the GSM then make it next this one is okay only okay then next next and uh, end, uh, end of list exit okay that's it uh, don't forget to uh, subscribe uh, video PlayStation. Once again, this is Richard Lincia, the technical support in charge in City Systems React.